Hello friends, today I'm going to show you how to take the backup of on-prem SQL databases to Azure Blob Storage and SQL Server 2019. Okay, so first I will jump to the uh, storage account. In the storage account, I have created one container with backup files. The name can be uh, with any name. Just go there and contain it with, I have created containers with, uh, with this permission okay and you can also go this container properties okay you can also see this access policy and not required so this is what exactly it means okay uh, now this is the storage account so now you need to create the credentials i will we can do this through gui and sql server command so generally i prefer to uh, create this using uh, t sql i will show the uh, how we need to do this in using gui in other video okay right now this is the command okay so create credential this is a credential key name can be anything you are creating that key okay you can give any name this has to be your storage account name okay and the secret where did i get this secret means here um, go to access keys so here if you show here it will get copy card here we have two keys so right now i took this okay key and you have to paste it here okay in this between you have to paste it so now i am going to create it so once you get the uh, once you created the credential click on the instance and refresh here come to security credentials you are now you are able to see this key now we we can use directly the negative backup command to take the blob storage click execute if you see messages here see it got completed successfully i will show you go to portal here container backup files see hash dot uh, file got generated now uh, so i already deployed a uh, hola maintenance script to so i will ping the description i mean i will how we can do that i have done in the separate video i will ping that video in the description box or the or at the or at the end of the video so this is the database command okay so i have deployed in the master select the script and i'm selecting the master okay now so here i am taking i want to take only one user database that's why i mention it is if you want to take all the databases you can mention user databases okay so this is my blog file so just go to container uh, just click on containers right click uh, select container properties here you can copy that container name okay this is the credential key uh, what kind of backup that you full either you want to compress or not why yes verify it means so either the either it is going to success or failure that kind of message it is going to write in the table okay right now just select that and click execute yeah it's got completed see if you see here restore verify only is cut successful okay complete outcome succeed okay now go to this uh, containers uh, just refresh it click on backup files so this is my system name dollar instance name it will create the folder hasha folder on full So this is the backup. Okay. So this is how we need to take the backup using Vola. Okay. So now what I will do here is let's experience what uh, what error we get if the uh, someone uh, will rotate the key, will change the key. Click on show. Here I am rotating the key one. Click yes. I have changed the access key. Okay, now come back to this key and take that 
create a database something like f okay now click execute so it is still taking the old key right okay now go on the uh, click refresh okay now take again the backup am um, now go and uh, open new connection okay see uh, i got this error it means whenever you get this error it means your access key is what um, refresh okay but if i do this here so i am got this error okay uh, it means sometimes the old connection still exists that's the reason it got I mean previously it got success but when i take the fresh connection so i got the error so if you go and see here containers c2 files are there means it was used to previous the connection so i am going to uh, give the error as well in the description box and all the commands okay i hope you may like this video thank you